Okay, um, I'm continuing my uh, Pixelated Tuesday with a look at uh, Terry and Sarva. Let's just turn the volume down a bit. So this is a game uh, I backed on Kickstarter. I played the uh, demo, the wine version, with wine rather, uh, last July. Now, although uh, it did release for Linux, I wasn't able to get it actually running on my machine until this week. Well, it turns out. Oopsie. Alright, let's just get the keys right. It turns out that in common uh, oh dear. in common with many uh, game maker games what this actually needs is a particular font installed it's uh, something like. Alright, let me just. Um... There we go. It's a legacy, a legacy 8 bit font of some kind. Legacy 8 bit font, sorry, getting distracted by actually playing the game. Which uh, which the game maker runtime just doesn't like not having installed for some reason. Oh, it didn't die. So I've been uh wanting to play this for a while. But I've been sort of putting it off until uh, I actually get the thing running. So now you can see it does it does work fine for me. The only bit that doesn't really work the only bit that doesn't really work is uh, the controller support. Alright. So what I'm doing here, you may not have realised as I was going along, is uh, I'm going around, I'm turning these red buttons on. So these things let me, uh, oh, save the game. Right. Oopsie. Oopsie. Ooh. So, I really wish I had control support for this, because I think it would make a lot of this a lot easier. Still on a 
figure out what I'm doing here, really. Oh, wrong way. There we go. Let's load that up again. There we go. So that's what it's in there. So, it's a platform game, clearly. There's some uh, puzzle stuff going on. There's a lot of things to collect. A lot of things to shoot. The secret areas. Right out. Secret areas. Not that I've found any so far. Wow. Ah, oh, see, there's a thing. Well, I have found some, but before, before you started uh, watching. Save points at uh, reasonable locations. Ooh. Ah. Like where you do stupid things like that. I'm not a really good at the job of explaining this game. It's true. But uh, hopefully you're, you're seeing the mechanics. Uh, platforming, there's flying. There's secret areas. Scooting along the sky here. It's obviously a, a homage to a homage to a classic 16-bit. Classic 16-bit platform games, which I was never very good at anyway, but it's still quite fun. Now, let's see. Can I get in there? No. Gear things. Uh, presumably now I can go back in here and fly it this way. Yeah. 
Oh no. So that's water, which is interesting. Oh, I forgot to save. Grenade. Oh dear. That's a grenade. That's what happens when you press the S key instead of the A key. I might just have to save again there. But yes, if you like those uh, old old Nintendo platform games, harkening after that sort of experience, this is uh, worth checking out. I'll put the uh, I'll put the exact package I needed to install on Fedora uh, in the description of the video. So I suspect it will be uh, it will be a similar. Um, Similar issue on any other game maker games you might might come across. And uh, yeah, Journey Saga. It's been in a few bundles. It's it's worth checking out. I think. So yeah, I'll stop. I'll stop rumbling on now and concentrate on playing the game, which maybe I should have done all along, because I'm just not good at these things. Talking and platform at the same time, just just far beyond me, I think. Check it out for yourselves, anyway. <laughs>